Happy hour. Swedish episode. Bork, bork. Let's get started. Yay, yay. One, two, three, four. This is the show where we make drinks and drink together in the kitchen and we do all sorts of things. Drinking and cooking and cooking and drinking. I know what you're thinking, but we're only good friends. You don't know where you're going unless you know where you come from. Papa. Papa. Alrighty, guys. I'm in the traditional Swedish garb. Bork, bork. Anyway, we're going to be making Swedish meatballs. It's generally a very simple dish, but there's a few things that make it Swedish. We're gonna do those things. Before we get to that food, though, mm -hmm. hey, let's have our snow, have have our snells, a little Swedish, Swedish snack. Have ourselves a little Swedish snack. Have a snack, a need a Swedish snack. Here we go, the connect abroad. You know, we have some fans in Swedland. Yeah. And they're not going to be happy with us. I mean, look at how we're dressed. We're not taking it seriously. Connect abroad. That's what it looks like. Yeah. We picked these up at Ikea, where you buy all your Swedish things. That's the only Swedish store we have in America. You don't know, but you're surrounded by a lot of Swedish things. Yeah, I mean, you got a chair named G Dirty Curd. You got a bed named Herstel Broad. Anyway. We're having a Swedish snack, all right? We're having herring. These are two of the more popular styles. One with herbs, one with mustard. And what you're supposed to do is you have it with knackerbrod. Knackerbrod. Pick it up when the next time you pick up a couch or a bed. We're gonna put it on the cracker bread. Now we have the one with mustard. It definitely looks a little bit creamier than I'm used to seeing jarred fish. I think we're supposed to have this with sour cream and some onions and a little bit of dill. Oh, nope, missed it. Some onions. Okay, all right. Okay, right? Oh. You see that? Let's give that a shot. Do you want the one that's a little bit jizzy or the one that's a little bit watery? Hmm. You know what? Before we get to that, though, we oh. have to make sure we enjoy it with a little bit of drink. Oh, yeah. These little things right here, it's called snaps. We're not gonna lie, we got these things straight from Sweden. Not this Ikea stuff. Don't be fooled. Yeah. But here's item number one from our friends from TVGA in Sweden. We had friends come over and give us stuff. Yeah, from the Swede land. All Where right. People are sweet and life is sweeter. This is important because snacks and schnapps go together like... Like hurdy and gurdy. I don't know what these words say. Nope. That's just a bunch of old looking letters. So there's 10 shots at 40% alcohol. This is going to be an exciting, bad episode. Yeah. Hair guards. Pop, pop. Oh, it tastes like black licorice. Not bad. Let's have a snack. Here's the jizzy one. Mmm. Not bad. Mine's a little sweet for my taste, honestly. Want to try this one? Mustard. Yeah, mustardy. I like mustard. The mustard one is better than the herb one. If you gave that to me and said, what is that? I wouldn't say fish. Right? It's, it's not bad. I can see that this would be good if it wasn't from Ikea. That is a grade A, maybe. Let's have some more snacks. Lacco slots. Herbal. It's herbal. Fennelly. Licorice-y. A lot of licorice in this culture. Oh, another gift. We got this candy. Turkish pepper. Turkish pepper. Yep. Flew it all the way over here. You want one? Here you go. Not even close. Nope. <laughs> Thank you. Check the hat. I'm the chef. Let's make some meatballs. 50% beef, 50% pork, eggs, breadcrumbs, onions, allspice. That makes it Swedish. Let's go. Also, this candy in my mouth tastes weird. It's like a salty licorice. It's black. It's black. Snaps, this one is skein akavi. Pop up. Or how they say it in the Swede land, skull. We got a food processor. We're gonna pulse all the ground meat in it because we want that meat to be nice and mixed and springy. It's important. First onion. We have this old croissant. These are gonna be our breadcrumbs. Heavy cream. Nice. Pepper. Salt. Eggs. Beef. Pork. This candy's not good. It's still in my mouth. Just a touch of allspice. Hey, we got some beer straight from Sweetland too. Another gift. Boom, 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 boom. My turn. Let's look at them. Beer bli bibliotech. Hip hops. Egypt. Imperial stout. Booyah. Electric nurse. Deepa. Double Indian pale ale. Cool art on it. Mohawk extra IPA. Year round beer. Shout out to Mohawk Brewing Company. So we're gonna make these into, you know, reasonable meatballs. You've all been to Ikea. You know what meatballs are, mother Come on, guy. man! There's a lot of other sites where you can find out what you're actually doing. You're watching because I wear a little bow tie and that guy's got a lot of words on his shirt you don't understand. 
That's why you're watching this show. That's a good segue into this shirt. This was a gift too. This is straight from the Swede land, baby. What does that say right there? And store cook and clan I and mill That means a big penis is better than a bad family? Something like that. Absolutely. Something like that. It's an old Viking saying. A big penis is better than any family, I think. Any family. You, you don't need a family after that. Your penis is your family. This candy, I still have it. It's you still in my mouth, yeah. It's been bad the whole time. It's just part of my mouth. Yeah. It's like a STD right now. Ooh, I bit into it. Ooh, that is... Uh. Yeah? Oh. Wow. Oh, I just salted the middle. Why would you do that? Ooh. This is your number one candy? Ooh. Word? Ooh. But hey, that's your candy. I respect it. Yeah. You All know right? what? That's why you're hardworking people, because you don't really know what pleasure is. Pop, pop. Skull. Skull. That is a fantastic beer. Electric Nurse, the double IPA, quite malty. What? What is this? This is crazy. That's dumb, right? That's stupid That's good. so good. Deep chocolatey notes. That's that's fantastic. I like that. Bork Bork! This episode so far has been sponsored by TVGA. TVGA, where you go and get the sweet life. Hey yo! I made as many meatballs as I could. What I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna fry it in a little cast iron with some oil, and we're gonna brown it on each side. We're going to uh, take them out. We're going to make a quick little gravy with all the brown bits in the pan, and then we're gonna put the meatballs back in to finish with the gravy, and then we're gonna serve that. Trust me, whatever. The other thing that you'll come across a lot in Swedish cuisine is lingonberry. And they're these little delicious little red berries that are a lot like cranberries. And they make wonderful things with all of this, but we're gonna make a little quick sauce, a lingonberry sauce, with just lingonberries, raw, fresh, from Sweden. They fucking came from Sweden. You can't get lingonberries here. I don't even know fucks. where they would, well, they would I sell. I never, why would you get lingonberries? I never heard of lingonberries. Sugar. Two to one. Don't ask questions. You know what else we got from, from the Swede land? Another shirt. I'm gonna do a magic cut right here. Ah, uh, here's another gift from TVGA. Oh, shiza. It's Baska Dropper. Boom. Swede the chef. I got the snaps. You just wanna brown them all sides, sear them, and we're gonna cook them up later. Pop, pop. Skull. Oh, cinnamon. It is like the bitterest bitter that I've ever uh. bitter tasted. All my favorite foods are in dick and ball form. You know, meatballs and bananas, pretty good together. Ice cream and dildos, pretty good together. Electric nurse, love it, love it. TVGA, you guys are saints. And you sent like the prettiest, nicest, sweetest looking dude. Jorgen, no. Ah, Oh, that oil's hot. Hey guys! Hey! We're having fun! Enjoy it! Cold Pop. beer! What am I drinking? This is like a stout or something. You got the Imperial Stout. It did you? Snaps. Skull? Skull. Grassy floral plant, some sort. Jorgen, what is this? Jorgen! Jonas? Oh shit. I don't know what Jonas looks like. He's wearing glasses. He looks kind of crazy too. How many school shootings do, does Sweden have? Because it looks like you guys all shoot up schools. These beers. <laughs> These beers, right? They're good. It's you literally good. gave us all the alcohol that we needed. Yeah. Good job, Sweden. Bark pork, I ruined my shirt! I'm very hot. I finished this beer. Pop, pop. This is number nine. It's not number nine. What the fuck? I thought those were empty. It's not number six. Skull. Skull. That is the my favorite. Yeah, that's probably that's the best wild. one so far. It's DP Anderson. Who are you showing it to? That camera, bitch. Dude. Oh, oh. We're not playing Titanic today. We're not. Dennis is definitely drinking an equal amount. Yeah. I can't taste what's in it. Time to make a cocktail. Here you go. But before we get to the cocktail, we gotta chew some tobacco. This is a part of the episode where we might throw up. Oh. I think you put it between your lip and the gum of your teeth. Show them where it says rapes. It says rape right there. It's Gutenberg rape extra rape. I, like mine comes in little baggies, so that's a little bit more obvious. Watch me. Ah, uh, right here, right here. We just hold on to it here, right? Put one of these in the other side of your mouth, right? Oh, oh, oh. No, I like it. 
<laughs> I'm gonna throw up soon too, I think. <gasps> He's throwing up! I'm afraid to swallow anything, so I'm like, my spit's coming out of my mouth. Oh, am I having fun right now? I'm just not moving my mouth. <laughs> this is like. Don't do chewing tobacco, yo. <sighs> I'm just gonna fly my out. I enjoy it. I like it. It's so good. I like chewing the back. I like schnapps. It's so good. Oh, the sweet life. Sweet life's good. <laughs> you got peaks and you got valleys. You got peaks and valleys. When that's, you drink schnapps, that's the Swedish way. Sweet life. Now I'm back up. We made our uh, meatballs in that pan. We're gonna put a, a wedge of butter in there and some flour. Hey, we have a cocktail. I kind of made it up. It involves lingonberries, lime, vodka, and simple syrup. Lingonberries. Throw them at the bottom of this mixing glass. 20 to 30 of them, all right? Quarter of a lime. Muddle. Two ounces of vodka. Do you want one of these? Nope. I'm gonna put it in my mouth. Go ahead, I threw up once already. It tastes worse the second time around. It's good just to just muddle every step. That's my directions, that's just what's happening, okay? Right here, does it. Why would you do that? Done the dead in that. Alrighty, curdy, curd. Why would you do that? Spread it around. You're right. It's all over my mouth. I'm just trying to be a good sweet. I you swear to God, God if I fucking throw up. Well, what? don't eat. Why would you put it like that in your mouth? Skull. Skull. Very That's nice a color. nice red color there. Hello. Forgot the, 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 the simple syrup, right? We're just gonna throw it in there before we shake it up. You wanna throw the simple syrup in there, alright? Lingonberries. Boom, boom. In the cocktail. Do you see this shit? You don't get this shit in the US. That's beautiful. Oh, that's so good. That's beautiful. Look at our meatballs finishing in that delicious gravy. Oh no! That's hot gravy on your leg! Alright, I'm taking off my shorts. We have the meatballs. They're sitting in their own gravy. A little bit of mash. Lingonberry. And a little bit of sugar. Bam! Yeah, that's nice. Why do you have your leg up? We finished our meatballs, right? We got our meatballs and gravy. We got our mashed potatoes. We got our lingonberry. We got Gabe's leg. We also have a cocktail. It's called Gabe's Swedish Sensual Summer Splash. Also known as the Jizz. Pop up. That tobacco was fucking goddamn gross. So these these meatballs, this these potatoes, they're delicious, right? But in Sweden, they have a traditional dessert. That dessert is cinnamon buns. Cinnamon. Oh my god, it's hot! Happy Sweden episode. We're having dessert, and that's cinnamon buns. Ow. Imagine just having. Ow. Happy hour. One, two, three, four. Thank you, TVGA, Jonas, and Jorgen, specifically. Papa, thank you very much for this episode. We love you. <laughs>